What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kareem Jovian and today is day six of Ramadan. So if you're still fasting, good on you. If you missed a day like me, then you can make it up. That's what I'll be doing at the end of this month. For those who are worried about me for my last vlog, I am getting a little better now and I'm taking medicine and I'll be going to the doctor tomorrow. So don't worry, thank you so much for all your concerns. Today is a skit that I wanted to put together about something that I've been experiencing for such a long time as a YouTuber and as a Muslim. Even if you're not a Muslim, you've experienced this too. Have you ever had these people who come into your life acting all judgmental, high and mighty, so pious, making it seem that they are better than you, but then in reality, they are much worse or even just not practicing what they preach? One of the biggest ones is having a girlfriend. As you all know, by now, I have a girlfriend. She took off her hijab. I, I thought she was Muslim, you know? Like, I didn't expect her to take it off. Yeah, of course she's still Muslim, bro. Like, it, the... What are you what are you saying? Bro, are you even Muslim? Why are you even protecting? Are you serious me? right now? Like of course I am. There's no such thing as a perfect Muslim. We're not perfect Muslims. Oh Kareem, he didn't tell me your friend is here. Oh hey, what's up, babe? This is my girlfriend Vlada. Astaghfirullah. Kareem, you're disgusting. You're such a horrible Muslim, Kareem. I never expect this from Kareem. Kareem, you're gonna go to hell, Kareem. Hello? Hey, babe. Yeah, I was actually just talking about you. Yeah, I miss you so much. Are we still down for the club or no? Oh God, I love when you talk like that. I miss you, I miss your big booty. This actually happened to me, but this particular skit was over-exaggerated for comedy purposes. I didn't find out on the spot that he had a girl. I just found out a couple of days that, oh no, he didn't have a girlfriend. He wouldn't do such a thing. I found out that he actually um, likes getting massages. You know, the really, really deep massages. And I hear that he can make you really happy by the end of it. Sometimes, I really just don't understand it. Why would you tell someone not to do something when you're doing the same exact thing? So crazy. I'm surprised to be honest. Yeah, I was yeah, really but surprised. It's, it's never gonna happen again. I'm yeah. telling you. Oh wait, my mom's calling. Hey. Yeah, mom. How are you? Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm on the train right now. I'm on the train right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be there in five minutes. Okay, I can't wait to see you. All right. Yeah. Okay. Bye, mom. Bro, you're lying to your mom. Bro, your mom raised you, and you're lying to her. You're disgusting, cream. Honestly, I never expect this from you. You're late, say you're late. Why are you lying to her? Are you even Muslim, bro? Honestly, our religion teaches us not to lie. And you're lying to your mom? Out of everyone, your mom? You're a disgrace. You should be ashamed to call you. Give me a second, I gotta call. Hello? Hey, mom. Yeah, look, look. okay. Okay. I have the medicine, I have it, it's with me. Yeah, I'll be home in two minutes. I'll take the medicine and I'll... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll be home in two minutes, alright? I have the medicine, don't worry. Okay, all right, bye. Yo, bro, you know where I can get medicine from? You didn't get the medicine for your mom? Nah, listen, just... Do you know where I can get it? She really needs it. So you basically just lied to your mom too? Bro, it's a small lie, it's not that big of a deal. Come on, man, do you know where I can get it? Don't even get me started on the guys who tell women to wear hijab. If a woman wants to wear hijab, she will wear the hijab. If she doesn't want to wear the hijab, she won't wear the hijab, whether you like it or not. Oh my gosh, I have seen some comments, especially in my videos, and I've seen people talk about how a woman is not a Muslim until she wears the hijab. I truly believe that every girl should wear hijab, no matter what she wants or what she thinks. They should wear hijab, because I never looked at a girl sexually, and I don't want to begin to. How would you feel if someone came to you and caught a mistake that you made and then tells you you're a horrible Muslim, you're a disgrace, you're going to hell? How would you react? One of the biggest things I hate in my community is when someone comes to you and tells you you're not a Muslim. Oh, man. What happened? F Did you just curse while you're fasting? In Ramadan? Yeah, why? Bro, I thought you were fasting. Bro, come oh on, man. God. You're not even a Muslim no more. You're not, you're not even fasting anymore. 
Like, what, what are you even doing here? You should, like, start walking. Bro, I didn't mean it, okay? I'm just fasting and, and I'm having a stomach ache and, and it's just really painful. Sometimes I just, I question if you're even a Muslim. You know, you tell people, oh, I'm a Muslim, but are you really a Muslim? Because a Muslim wouldn't curse, especially while they're fasting. I thought you were fasting. No, nah, bro, I couldn't wake up on time today. Are you serious? Yeah, why? What, you want some? I mean, you might as well have since you broke your fast. Since when were you God? A stuck for a law, bro? Because you're not God. You cannot tell me if I'm a Muslim or not. That's something that God brings upon us. And didn't God say everyone is born a Muslim? So if you say to someone that you are not a Muslim, you are going against God's word. You're doing worse than the sin I just committed that you're trying to correct me for. You're basically saying, God, you are nothing. Because I right now am making the decision that you are not a Muslim. Think hard when you're telling someone you're not a Muslim because it makes you look so stupid. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button and please subscribe and turn on that notification bell. And if you are a wonderful person, which I know you are, you're probably going to comment below some kind words. That would be nice, all right? If you are a supporter, please take that time to comment below something positive. Show that positivity could outwin negativity. For some reason, the negative people are always there. They always have time to write horrible things. So hit those like buttons. Keep going crazy with the like buttons. Don't ever stop. Every time you see my video, hit that like button. And if you want to really support me, you can monetarily support me on Patreon or become a member of this channel by clicking the join button below this video. Until next time, I will see you the Frida. You've been watching him for years. Hi. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, guys? Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, guys? Hey, what's up, guys? How's it going, guys? Welcome to my channel. He's made you laugh. Hey, man. <laughs> He's made you cry. You always say you're sorry. You're not sorry, okay? You're not sorry. I'm telling you that you are 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 not sorry. You know, well, we're, we're gonna look out for each other. Hey, man. Hey, 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 hey. It's all right, man. It's all right, it's all right. Hey, how you doing, Mark? What's this? You didn't have to. The money was for you, man. Thank you. Okay, thank you so much, man. Of course I will. Oh, this is my favorite. Thank you so much, Mark. And now he's doing it all over again on his new show. Jovian Entertainment presents The Kareem Jovian Show. You cuckoos are in for a ride. Kareem Jovian in My Awkward Muslim Life. Is he Egyptian? I don't drink. Oh, no, yeah, I, it's I, fine. I'm so no, sorry. It's no, totally I have no, I, 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 no idea. Hey, everybody, Kareem does not drink, he is Muslim. The first of many episodes. As you know, Karim, your numbers have taken a huge dip on your channel. And we have a few ideas we'd like to run by you. Really, guys? Come on. Now, I know she's a lady, but we still gotta respect her because she's hot. Those Muslims, they always destroy every place they go. I don't care if you look like you're capable of growing a beard. You're not welcome here. Get out! It all starts this August 9th which is also Kareem's birthday. And a happy birthday to my greatest friend. Kareem, why don't you have a drink? Uh, I can't, I'm sorry. Come on, just one drink. No, I really, really can't. Follow him at Kareem Jovian. Subscribe and like. I just wanted to say, you are so beautiful. See you the f later.